Middle school students in southwest Austin are home safe tonight, thanks in part to their principal. Matthew Nelson has taken it upon himself to fill in as a crossing guard while the city works to hire more. KXAN's Brianna Hollis spent a pickup shift with Nelson this afternoon. Hi right, guys, you ready? Here we go. Turkey Day Trot. The intersection of Monterey Oaks and Staggerbrush, so busy, can be a scary place for kids after class at small middle school. But lucky for them, see you in nine days. It's Mr. Nelson. You guys coming? To the rescue. With us, our admin team, we don't want to put a teacher, a staff member, or a parent in these positions because they're they're sort of dangerous. Parents love how he is with the kids, and they love that he stepped up but they're frustrated that he had to in the first place. I think that it's really unfortunate that we don't have a crossing guard. I've been going on, I guess, for the better part of two years now. Mr. Nelson says a full-time crossing guard worked the post before the pandemic, but they haven't had one since. Bye, Ruby. At the beginning of the school year, 55 crossing guard positions still needed to be filled. Usually when there's a gap, the city says crossing guard supervisors fill in, but the one covering small retired. The city tells us they hope to interview candidates for that position next month. Good afternoon. Until then, it's up to Mr. Nelson. He cares about the kids. Don't mention those chicken nuggets. And we obviously need someone to do this. We're thankful that we have Principal Nelson and the team at Small to step in. Brianna Hollis. We love you. We'll see you in nine short days. KXAN News. And a safe break to all those students and teachers. The city says the current vacancies are through normal attrition. When the city can't staff a location, the Public Works Department says it supplies volunteers and school staff with training and equipment. And as of tonight, the city says there are about a dozen crossing guard vacancies.